First at noon, for the first time ever, we are seeing surveillance video. It's showing the death of a tin roof patron at the hands of a security guard. Thanks for joining us this Wednesday afternoon. I'm Holly Thompson. And I'm Amanda Hara. The guard, Richard Cornelius, knocked Austin Turner unconscious after the two got into a fight at the tin roof. Here is that surveillance video. It's captured by the business that was right next door. You see Cornelius escort Turner out of the bar, then throw multiple punches at him as Turner tries to walk away. One of the punches hits Turner right in the head, and you can see that's when he goes down right next to a hot dog stand. Well, Turner was in a coma for weeks with a fractured skull before he died. Today, his family came face to face with Cornelius in court. Two other security guards who were also working that night were there as well. And one of them says the video does not show the full story because Turner is actually the one who started the fight. Well, the guard testified that Cornelius kicked Turner out of the bar two different times that night. The first time was completely routine, but Turner somehow snuck back in, and the second time they say he refused to leave. I see Mr. Turner, right as he walks out the door, push for a number of time, Mr. Cornelius. The defendant follows him and throws multiple punches with Mr. Turner's back turned to him. So are you saying that that's appropriate conduct for a security guard? I'm not saying that at all. Well, court has now wrapped up for the day. We are still combing through all of the testimony. Reporter Marissa Sulik will have the very latest coming up later today on WSNB.